The casuals are an untold story because they developed outside of the normal realms of youth fashion. Basically everybody wanted to attach themselves to the most expensive sports where they could get their hands on to. Casual's still got that mystique about it. Casual's still got that. Ooh, I don't quite know, I'm not sure about that. Fred Perry's, straight jeans, uh, training shoes. You know, you had Munchen, Adidas jeans, an absolute beauty of a shoe. Forest Hills, Adidas worked with NASA for the technology in the sole. There was something about that feeler F and that boxed feeler F, especially with the ball logo, that was just so very different. If you wanted to be part of the firm that was going to football, you, you were a football casual, so you football casual, yeah, that, that was part and parcel of it. With our firm, we had all different races and different cultures. We didn't care what, where you were from, if you was poor, if you was rich, if you was from a different social background, if you were from a different religious background, we didn't care. It wasn't about that. Society had nothing to say about the good about the casual movement, but I loved it. I thought it was exciting and it was a way of you know putting our stomp on. It was empowering. Everybody had their own journey. It doesn't matter where you came from in the country, it doesn't matter what, what football club you were in, we all cared about it, we're all passionate about it still but it's, it just means something very different to me in London as it does to someone in Liverpool, Manchester or up in Scotland.